Pakistan Air Force's latest projects. Yesterday, President Asif Ali Zardari visited the PAF Nepi Institute, where he received a briefing on ongoing projects under the NAS Tech Sensor Division. Following the visit, the Pakistan Air Force, PAF, issued a press release, including a widely shared image that highlights several key projects in development. Among these, the most significant is Pakistan's first indigenous passive ground-based radar system, currently being developed under Yai Next Tech. <music> Understanding Passive Radar Systems To better grasp the importance of this development, let's compare active and passive radar systems. Active radar emits electromagnetic waves, which bounce back upon hitting an aircraft, providing crucial information like altitude and speed. However, this also alerts the aircraft that it has been detected and reveals the radar's location. Passive radar, in contrast, does not emit any signals. Instead, it detects radio waves naturally emitted by aircraft communication systems. This gives passive radar a crucial stealth advantage making it undetectable to enemy forces and highly effective in modern warfare. Why Passive Radar Matters In today's combat environment, SEED, suppression of enemy air defenses, and DEAD, destruction of enemy air defenses, missions are common tactics where adversaries use anti-radiation missiles to disable air defense systems. Since passive radars do not emit radiation, they remain immune to such attacks, making them far more difficult to locate and destroy. Limitations of passive radar. Despite its advantages, passive radar systems do have some drawbacks. They generally have shorter detection ranges than active radars. Active radars, with their high-powered electromagnetic emissions, offer greater range and surveillance capabilities. Because of these differences, PAF plans to integrate both active and passive radar systems in its defense network. Passive radars will be deployed in high-risk electronic warfare environments, where enemy jamming or anti-radiation threats are present. Active radars will be used for long-range target detection, tracking, and engagement. Pakistan's Indigenous Passive Radar Development the development of an indigenous passive radar system is a major milestone for Pakistan Air Force and NAS Tech. This flagship project has already made significant progress and is now in advanced development stages. Once fully developed and tested, the system will be integrated into PAF's radar network, working alongside ground-based long-range surveillance radars and air defense systems. This will enhance Pakistan's ability to counter emerging aerial threats effectively. <laughs>